Alrighty, so today I'm going to be drawing the Scion logo as a monster. For context, Scion was a car brand that was manufactured by Toyota, and it was meant to be a car brand that would be marketed at young people, and so as such, Scions, more so than not, tended to be a little bit cheaper than not, but they were still too expensive for young people to afford, and the people who actually ended up really liking Scions were actually old people. So it was a complete failure, and now Scion is gone. But I really like Scions, and I think the Scion logo is pretty cool. And so as such today, I figured I would try to make a monster out of the logo and see how it goes. And so as such, well, that is exactly what I'm going to be doing today. I don't know if this is really going to work all that well, but I'm going to give it my best shot nonetheless. Today, I'm going to be drawing in my Soho Urban Artist Brick Sketchbook. And today, I'm going to be drawing with my... Pencil Graph Gear 500, 0.5 mechanical pencil. If I need to erase any of the lines, I'm going to be using my Tombow Mononoc 3.8 mechanical eraser. And then to finish off the drawing, I'm going to be using my Pilot G2. Oh, I grabbed my 0.7 by accident. I'm going to be using my Pilot G2 0.38 millimeter pen. I grabbed my 0.7 by accident. Whoopsies. But I'm going to be using my uh, Pilot G2 0.38 millimeter size pen to finish the drawing off. Without further ado, though, let's go ahead and get my sketchbook all opened up. And let's go ahead and see if I can draw the logo from memory. I did take a look at the logo last night, so let's hope I can get this uh, going good. But I do suppose there's only one way to find out, and that is to actually go ahead and get some graphite out of my mechanical pencil. And now let's go ahead and give it a shot. So the Scion logo as a whole is much more oval than not. It's very much kind of almost like that. It's a bit too ovally, I'd have to say. Let's go and give it another shot. That's definitely too much of an oval. Not quite a circle, not quite like a full oval kind of thing like that, but a little bit more ovally than not, I definitely have to say. Let's go and try it again. Oh, man. You know what? I'm going to stick with that. Then there's kind of a line, like going through the middle, like that. And it's like, it's like a little thing going down here. And then it kind of like continues down like that or something like that kind of thing. And I think that's the Scion logo. I've got a Scion hat somewhere. Where's my Scion hat? Where's my Scion hat at? I misplaced my Scion hat. I have, I have one somewhere. Where is it? I need to take a look at the logo. There you go, I found it. Okay. So this is what the logo looks like. So not quite what I've drawn, not quite what I've drawn, although not terrible. I think I might restart this. And uh, now that I actually have a reference, now that I actually have a reference, I think I'm going to be able to do this a little bit better. As I'm sure is obvious by the fact that I own a Scion hat, I do like Scion as a brand a decent amount. The Scion XB is a pretty cool car. Uh, let's go ahead and give this another shot, though. Let's see, I'm going to start up here. You know what? That's not perfect, but it will do. And I think I'm just going to leave the border just like that. I'm not going to do like an inside border or anything like that. I'm thinking, you know what? Actually, I might. I messed that up a little bit. There we go. Just like that. That should do the trick. And then now I'm going to want to go ahead and do a line going all the way across. So let's do a line going all the way across like that and like that. And then I'm going to want to start it off right about here. And I'm going to want to kind of take it down just like that. And then the other side I'm going to want to do like right here. And it's going to want to go down like that. And the other side, I'm going to want to start right about here, and it's just going to kind of go down like that. And then the other side is going to go like that. And that is more so than not the Scion logo. I do suppose I think the upper one right here definitely needs a little bit more curve. I 
And I think that should be probably all good now. Now I've got to go ahead. Do I want to give it some scion text or do I just want to kind of have the logo be in how it be kind of thing? I think I'm going to actually leave, leave it uh, textless. I don't think I'm going to do any sort of a logo or anything like that kind of thing. Now I've got to figure out how to make this into a monster. And so I've got a couple different options. I could either make these two areas up here into eyes, or I could add eyes and a mouth to the center right here. And I'm kind of wanting to go for the second option. I'm kind of thinking that would be more funny. So I'm kind of thinking I'm going to do that. So I'm going to do like a little tiny nose right there. Do like a mouth, like right here. I'm going to do like an eye right there. And an eye right there. Just like that. Like a bunch of teeth, I'm just going to add those in with a pen. And some little lines and stuff like that kind of thing. And I'm thinking, then after that, I'm going to go ahead and have some legs kind of coming down. Just like that kind of thing. And there we go. Well, that is the main sketch for the Scion monster. And as a whole, I think it looks pretty funny. I think I'm going to stick with this, and uh, I think uh, now, I'm going to judge it all up. I need to take a deep breath for a minute. I'm kind of out of breath for some reason. I don't know why. Probably because I smoke a decent amount of cigarettes. But, but, I do suppose, without further ado, I should probably go ahead and put my mechanical pencil down and actually go ahead and get to finishing up the drawing and whatnot kind of thing with my Pilot G2 0.38 millimeter size pen. So let's go ahead and start going over all of these lines now with my pen. And... Let's go ahead and start finishing up the drawing. And there we go. So I've now gone all over the oh, I've now gone all over the lines. I've now gone over all of the lines once. So now I'm going to go ahead and just erase the pencil lines that are backing the pen lines up. And then after that, I'm going to go ahead and go over all of the lines once again with my pen. And I'm just going to go ahead and add some other details as well and whatnot. And basically just finish up the drawing as a whole. That is the plan at least. This uh, Tombow Mononaki racer I have, the mechanical eraser I'm using right now, it's a pretty good eraser though, I really like it. I bought it when I was in Japan a while back, and uh, it's a pretty good eraser. I really enjoy using it. It was a worthwhile purchase for like, I think I spent like three or four bucks on it. can't remember exactly. Worthwhile purchase nonetheless. Alrighty. So now let's go ahead and start going over all of these lines with a second layer. Just make all the lines just look a little bit more bold, a little bit more distinct, a little bit more finished, a little bit more complete, I do suppose, is pretty much the plan.
I think that's the drawing all done, y'all. Well, there we go. I think that's it. I think I do want to, this, line, this arm's a lot darker than this arm, so I do think I want to kind of fix this one up a little bit. But I think that's pretty much the drawing all done. Yeah. Well, I can't complain. I can't complain one bit. I am overall much more than not pretty satisfied with this drawing. I don't think it's like my best drawing ever per se, but I do think it's a better drawing than not, and I do like how it looks more so than not. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of this drawing. Do you guys like it? Do you guys not? Let me know in the comments down below, of course. And of course, please make sure to uh, like and subscribe for more content. I have my uh, Instagram, my book, my merch, my PO box, and my... Um, I have my Instagram, my book, my merch, my P.O. box, and my uh, main channel all in the description down below. That's what I was trying to say. Yeah, I have my Instagram, my book, my merch, my main, my... I've got more Jolly Jumbles up today. But anyway, let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of this drawing. And of course, please make sure to uh, like and subscribe for more content. I have my Instagram, my book, my merch, my P.O. box, and my main channel all in the description down below. Go check it all out. But uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching, y'all. Till the next one. Well, I do suppose stay safe and peace and have a great one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying.